Are you ready to write, write, write your thoughts, make your ideas clear? Tell the reader what you know and what you hold most dear. Grab your pencil, something to write on, your crayons or your markers, and definitely bring some ideas to the table today. Today I will be writing on the paper that we've been using in our classroom, but you don't have to have this special paper. You do need to put your name at the top because the first thing I do is write my name because I want everyone to know who drew these pictures and who wrote these words. So go ahead and get your paper ready to write. Today I brought an idea that I would like to write about. Um, I like to write about some of my favorite things. And so I've written about my family. That's a favorite thing of mine. But today I'm going to write about one of my favorite foods. And we've been enjoying this food um, from a local pizza restaurant. So we are actually going to be writing about pizza today. So I want to tell you about my favorite food. So I'm going to start my writing first. I'm going to start out by telling you what my favorite food is. I'm going to say, I like pizza. How many words are in that sentence? Let's say, I like pizza. Three. So I'm going to make three lines on my paper. And I'm telling you that. So I'm going to make sure that I have the right punctuation at the end. I is my first word. Like, L, I, K, E is my next word. And then pizza. P -p -p -p. And I remember, I see this word on the box every time I bring this home. So P, I, Z, there's two Zs. I always notice those. And then there's an A at the end. Pizza. I like pizza. Now, um, I know that we've been writing these lines underneath our words. There's going to be a couple lessons towards the end of the year where I'm not going to use those lines, and I'll show you how we can still write our sentences right. My next sentence is going to have a list in it, so I'm going to show you something new with punctuation. So I need you to know that it is this sentence. It has cheese, sauce, and crust. I'm telling you what's in the pizza that I really, really like. Now, I do like all kinds of pizzas, but cheese pizza has got to be at the top of my list. So it has cheese, sauce, and crust. It has cheese, sauce, and crust. Whoops, I got to put my pen down so I can count them all on my fingers. Six words to, on that in that sentence. It has cheese, I'm going to put a comma here, kind of like a pause mark. I'm making a list here. My next thing in my list is sauce. I'm going to put another comma. And then and crust. Ooh, I can squeeze it right in there and put the period at the end. I'm telling you all the ingredients in my favorite pizza. So let me go ahead and write that sentence. It need an uppercase I because it's the beginning of the sentence. I, T, it, has, that's a sight word. So spell it with me. H, A, S, has cheese. Ch, ch. Yep, that's right. C, H, E. We're going to put a double E so it says that. Cheese. Cheese. Sauce. Sauce. and crust. You help me with crust. K -k. Yep, C. R, 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 uh, 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 U, S, 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 T, T, T. Thank you for helping me with that one. This actually is a pretty big word, and you spelled it perfectly. Let's read our sentence to make sure it's all there. It has cheese, sauce, and crust. Okay, so I want to know, do you like pizza? That's actually going to be my last sentence. Do you like pizza? Let's count the words. Do you like pizza? That's four words. Do you like pizza. <gasps> that's not telling you something. That's asking you something. So I need to put my question mark at the end for my punctuation. Do is D-O. You, do you remember how to spell that? Y-O-U. 
like, oh, I used that in my first sentence in case I forgot. L-I-K-E, pizza. Oh, just like on the box and right in that first sentence. P-I-Z-Z-A. Now let's read our whole writing. I like pizza. It has cheese, sauce, and crust. Do you like pizza? Oh, I think this is great writing. I'm glad I have all the words that I want to be in my writing. Now I'm going to go ahead and draw a detailed picture. All right, so here's my detailed picture. I have drawn my cheese pizza right here. I have a slice of it. Oh, I even took a bite of it. And I like to drink Diet Coke, surprise, surprise, right along with my cheese pizza. So I wanted to make sure that you could see that it has cheese, so that's the white stuff here. It has crust, so that is the um, brown part here, and it has sauce as well. So that's why I put a little bit of red. You know how it kind of oozes out when you cut the pizza slices? I put a little red there so you could see the sauce. And I labeled the crust. I labeled the cheese. And I'm going to label the sauce right now. S-A-U-C-E. So you know all the parts of my yummy pizza. I even made a speech bubble here to let you know how much I like it. And I said, can you tell the what word that is? Yum. Yum. That is um, my favorite kind of pizza right there. I hope that you enjoyed writing along with me. You don't have to write about pizza. You can definitely write about what your favorite food is. I'd love to see your writing. So if you want to send me a picture, that would be great.